Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial with EC QuickBooks Training. In today's video, I'm going to discuss um, a discrepancy on the sales tax item that is non-taxable, but yet it's still trying to calculate some tax. So let's get started. I had a question asked to me about um, a discrepancy on the sales tax, and I'm going to explain this. I used an invoice, but this was actually a sales receipt for um, reconciliation of income in a restaurant for a restaurant. So the problem here is um, the tips is non-taxable. We have sales of product and then we also have discounts to food products and that is taxable. And then we have the amount received. Now there's a small discrepancy of 13 cents and they couldn't figure out why there was this discrepancy. If we calculate it, as you can see, it should be $32 uh, even. So we have $326.85 minus the $10 in food uh, times the sales tax percentage. It comes out to 32 And when we take out the uh, $45.79 for tips, see QuickBooks changes it to $32. But when you add it back in 45.79, there's a small oops. Let's see. There's a small discrepancy of 13 cents. So they couldn't figure out why. So I'm going to show you how to fix this. Um I don't know why QuickBooks would do this and I I I'm really interested in finding out and I will do more research but I knew right away because this happened to me years ago and I, I, I couldn't figure it out and I had forgotten about this tip but I'm going to share it with you today because I think it's very important um it is very important because then you will be wondering why you're also off in order to fix this you have to make sure that you have your discount I'm going to insert a line right under your product sales so let's put it there discounts ten dollars and we're going to delete this line okay as you can see now it became thirty two dollars even i don't know why when you put it under the tips or any other amount quickbooks is considering numbers above that line item so it was taking in account the 45.79 somehow uh, maybe it was averaging it out i don't know even though it was non-taxable quickbooks was still taking a fraction of that 45.79 so in order to fix that i told them to put it right below the sales product and we got the correct amount so i wanted to share that with you today in case you also need this this trick on this tip to help you out reconcile your sales receipt with um, uh, POS systems that you use for restaurants or any other POS system. I hope this helps and please don't forget to subscribe for more how to's tips and tricks and troubleshooting for QuickBooks. I will see you on the next one.